rubber bullets, tear gas, bomb shells, and 178 Palestinians were injured and 88 were hospitalized. Is the negligence of Salah. I'd just like to give a short message. As many of you may be aware, that unfortunately, yesterday, on the 7th of May, the 25th of Ramadan, and the 26th night of Ramadan, Masjid Al-Aqsa was stormed by the Israeli forces. And 178 Palestinians were injured, and 88 were hospitalized, according to the last report I read on Al Jazeera. Yesterday being the last Friday in the month of Ramadan, Tens of thousands of Muslims in Palestine, they attended the Juma Salah. And after the Juma Salah, there was a protest against the illegal evacuation of the Palestinians by the Israeli forces. Because of this protest, there was tension. And later on, the Israeli forces, they stormed Masjid Aqsa on the 7th of May, on Friday, on the 25th of Ramadan, which went on till the night of the 26th of Ramadan, 1442. And here, they fired many rubber bullets, tear gas, bomb shells, and 178 Palestinians were injured and 88 were hospitalized. I request and I urge all the Muslims around the world to unitedly support our Palestinian brothers and sisters and pray for them. And I urge the Muslims throughout the world, including the Muslim countries, to condemn the inhuman act done by the Israeli forces. All of us Muslims should support Masjid Aqsa, which is the third holiest mosque in the world. We have to unitedly stand and condemn this act. We have to support and see to it that Masjid Aqsa remains with the Muslims. I urge all the Muslims that they should pray for Masjid Aqsa and pray in support of the Palestinian brothers and sisters who are defending the third holiest mosque in the world, who are defending Masjid Aqsa. We pray for them to give them courage, to give them sabr, to continue their struggle against the Israeli forces, and we pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to help the Muslims to keep Masjid Aqsa. And we pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that may he teach the enemies of Islam a lesson. And Laitul Qadr, inshallah, High Chancellor would be there tonight or in the next couple of nights. This is the best opportunity where we can pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and ask for support from Masjid Aqsa against the Israeli forces.